Welcome back. Good Sunday morning to everybody. Hope you all had a good night's sleep. So I am thinking of making some French toast, but I don't want to make the French toast um, on the stove with all the butter and all that jazz. And so what I decided to do is, if you watch my uh, recipe, a few days ago, I made a almond flour whole grain bun. So I had about two more of that remaining. So I'm going to use those buns and make an oven bake French toast. Whole grain hops comes out when we put it in the oven and make some French toast. Continue watching and let's try out this recipe. Let's go. Click the bell for new videos. So let's get started. All right, so as I said, I have like two buns remaining. In case you missed that video, the link for that video would be on top. So you can go check out that video. So we're gonna cut this in half. So let me show you a reminder of what it looks like inside. So let's cut the bread in half. And that is what it looks like in the inside. See? Okay. So to make the French toast, I would have cut them in half. I'm not going to leave it whole because we want to make sure it is so properly true and true. All right, so let's stop the rambling and making this video extremely long for apparently no reason at all. So let's go. Before I continue, all of the ingredients will be in the description box. So once my mixture is properly well combined, I'm going to take my two pieces of bread and I'm placing into my buttered dish and I'm going to make sure that that milk mixture is properly soaked into my bread but not too soggy. And we're going to place it in our preheating broiler. So I place just enough milk so that the bread will absorb all of the milk mixture. So as you can see, there isn't any big amount in the pan. So I'll be back as soon as it is out of the broiler. Now I'm going to add my coconut syrup. As I said, the link for this coconut syrup would be above. And you can check out how I made my coconut syrup and also how I made my hot cross buns. So now that is done, we're going to give it a taste test. The pumpkin spice that I used was a blend that I made that is also on my channel. And I add cinnamon, that was just an extra added bonus. You don't need to add because it's basically already in the pumpkin spice. So you really don't need to add it into there. Alright? That's why I said it's optional. You know what this reminds me of? A coconut tart. A coconut tart. That's what this reminds me of. Mmm, that's good. 
this coconut syrup is in my the same buns that I made the um, hot cross buns I made that um, topping to go on the buns so you can check out my hot cross buns would be in the end screen and also in the cards above so you can check out how I made this coconut syrup it goes well with this oven bake French toast and was even wonderful on my hot cross buns. Thanks for watching this quick and easy Sunday morning French toast oven bake recipe. Have an awesome week. Bye.